You're listening to the True Bull Podcast with Gunny and Nemo. You want to hear it now, you want to hear it live. And that's right. Hey, tape recorder, listen to this. Whoa, we are back at the True Bull Virtual Cast, episode number 104. All right. Very excited for this one. Not be, not least because of uh, what a great uh, weekend it was with uh, Easter, but also because what we have got coming up for this episode. We got some new segments. We we're have in, a treat for you guys. We're introducing some new stuff for this one. We're going to actually uh, do one of our Vicks Liquor Picker, one of our reviews for... Uh, Glenn Morangi, Glenn Morgan Jungi. Hey, watch your language. I, I don't know how you pronounce it, but when I asked the guy at the bar how you pronounce it, he said, "You don't pronounce it, you drink it." So here we are. So yeah, about to do it. Yeah, we're, we're going to get that a little bit later, but you know the, the main event. Something special. The main event for uh-huh. episode 104 is the first episode of many that you will hear of super granny all right, all right. well yeah, yeah. she has uh you know been she's she's been a great part of our whole life she still is yeah. um, as you'll be able to tell from the uh, episode uh she is an unbelievable woman self-made taught herself how to read taught herself how to run a business taught herself how to raise kids all by herself and that's the original way uh, a reason why we called her super granny because there is no one like her. Nope. Nothing compare. Nope. Nothing compare not, to Super Granny. Not close. And so our homage to her was to create a superhero with a with a frilly cape uh, who has her powers passed down from from Welita to Welita. It is it really an homage? I you think, be the judge. I, I think it is. I think it is. Once you hear it, uh, you'll be able to feel the love that we got for Grandma because she. Uh, she she was the original of the badasses. Yeah, in true. the in the That's family, true. and still is. She's still the toughest person in the family. Without further ado, yeah, I think I think that's that's enough of an homage to her. Now let's let's let the uh, the uh, segment do the talking. Let's cue the theme music. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Super granny, super granny, super granny. When people need help. Super Granny, Super Granny, fast to the rescue when people need help. It's Janie. Our story begins with Hito leaving Doceros Market after running an errand for Granny. Hey, Sugar Shorts, what's in the bag? You bring enough for everyone? Yes, some sausage for my grannies. Oh, how sweet. Well, give her something for me, huh? Yeah, take that. Three hours later. No, no, no. Oh, you, you like that sausage, huh? No, I surely don't. The granny is certainly not going to like where you put the sausage. Well, you tell granny she's next. Meanwhile, at granny's house. Hito, what happened? And, and where is my sausage? You don't want to know where it is. There is a bad man and they did things that weren't really, really nice. It, it hurt like the dickens. Oh, no! They can't do that. That's not nice. That's not pretty, Hito. You, you just go take a nap. I, I have some shit to do. I'm going to go down to the vault. Chit! So Granny goes down to the vault to get the super cape and heads to the market. Are you the man that violated my hito? Yo, Biddy, you gonna clean my boots? No, but I'm gonna wipe the floor with your punk ass. And then another thing. Three hours later. That's right. And you just remember that, you punk ass. Confound you, Super Granny. I'll get you next time. Don't be an asshole. You be pretty. And so the universe is a safer place because of Super Granny. And that's right. Until next time. Fast to the rescue. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I got two words for you. Super 
grand dude that was amazing <laughs> i can't wait till the next episode i tell you what there's 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 some pretty good stuff but i i still have a question um yeah. what um what did happen to the sausage look right? man i don't know i wasn't there look all i know is that he left me a message after we were gonna you know send everything in and he said all he said was carpe chorizo and i don't speak espanol or 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 latin you're you're right but i'm pretty sure it says uh seize the weenie oh huh. in that in that case i don't want to know what happened to the sausage well hito if you're out there we we uh, are <laughs> certainly sorry we're really pulling for you yeah yeah they were pulling for him too that really made me parched yeah yeah i tell you what speaking of which you know always listening to super granny <laughs> makes me want to get fired up i tell you what oh, but that. that brings us to another segment our first segment of vix liquor picker all right all right here we go i can hear the ice j jingling around in my cup i hear that ice it's jingle jangle jingling <laughs> that's all i got okay so uh all right we're gonna give it a try give us one second glenn morangy mm. okay okay uh smoky mm-hmm mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yep definitely scotchy mm-hmm mm -hmm. and uh i'm gonna i'm gonna put it up there with uh uh, with uh, JMO, this is some good stuff. Yeah. Now, granted, this is only the ten year. Right. Right. We, we don't we don't have the twenty year because that's a little bit harder to get. Right. Uh, when was it? Last Christmas when we tried the uh, Glen Livet, we had like a six oh, or six or yeah. seven uh, 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 miscellaneous uh, flavors. We had like a twenty year, a twelve year. That was fantastic. That... Thank you for Clark Hamlet for uh, turning us on to that. Yeah. Thing. That was some good stuff. But All th of those flavors. I I'd, I'd put it right up there with that. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I, pretty close, pretty close for a right, ten year cam compared to the other ones, but yeah, it, it was it was like it reminded me, like you said, it was you. What, what did you say it was? It was smoky and strong, and, strong and smoky. Yeah, kind of like me. Yeah, it also reminded me of you. It was fruity but whimsical. Wow. So we both agree wow. it reminded us of you. We're fixing to call it here on uh, <laughs> on our virtual cast, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Thank you so very, very much for hanging in there. And enjoying and enduring this podcast. It was it was uh, it was one of them for the ages. And and once again, we want to thank everybody who came out yeah. um, uh, to Raymond Russell Park. We had a great time. Oh, yeah. We got some Super Granny shirts, merchandise, and stuff that we're um, selling, making, and uh, it was a great time. Uh, a fellowship with family, and uh, you know th th those are going to happen more. But uh, you're going to hear more about that on our uh, upcoming podcast. Um, again, we're still working on video streaming. Um, if you need a gun, Redline Guns, Josh Downs, find them on Facebook and uh, go buy a gun. We still have the flamethrower. I'm not giving it back. <laughs> it, you know, it's kind of like a birthday present. It was, to it put was it my on birthday. my guitar. Yeah. <laughs> well, you can put it on an AR-15. I'm guessing you can put it on a guitar, too. Oh, you could do that. Yeah. But uh, thank you to Redline Guns. Thank you to uh, Virtual Country for actually giving us this studio so we can have uh, carte blanche. Yep. And uh, thanks. we really appreciate them uh, doing that. Uh, you can look for uh, Virtual Country uh, on Spotify. Where else? You can find us on Apple Music, iTunes. Uh, you can find us on YouTube Music. Um, we're pretty much anywhere you can you can search. Uh, you can find us. Also, anything uh, anything in prints? Yes. For uh, any and all of your printing and service needs. All right. Yeah, no job too big, no uh, shirt too small, except for that extra small where you know it it you know it says tool con. Yes. Be honest. I'm the shirt guy. Yeah. I know what size you are. Just tell me. Look, man. I don't know that extra six bucks for the two XL. I don't know. Do I want comfort or do I want five bucks? I can get a cheeseburger on the way home. I'll then, take the six bucks. Well, oh, <laughs> I, I, of course you will. Of course you will. But again, that, that brings us to the end of episode number 104 of right. the True Bull virtual podcast. We are Goonie and Nemo. Thank you, Belgium, for listening in. Tell you what, Brussels, <laughs> baby. Oh, and Istanbul was Constantinople. Now it's Istanbul, wow. not Constantinople. It's great to be listened to and heard here, there, and everywhere. Uh, Fayetteville, North Carolina is listening. Asheville, Ashburg, Ash, Ashburg, Ashley, K Ashley. Kentucky. Yeah, Ash right. yeah. Ashburg. They're, they're listening all over. We got them in Austin. We're, they're listening, and uh, we're not going to shut up until they stop listening. So all keep right. on listening. Uh, thank you for everything. And until next time, remember Super Granny's words. Give me a chance. Um, I can say it like her, but I don't know. Is she around here? 
Give me a chin, hombre. No, 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 no. Oh, chin. And once again, Virtual Cast has been brought to you by nobody. nobody.